Hi again, this is Hadi. So as usual, today I'm visiting a new project. I'm visiting Taksim 360. As you can tell from the name, I am in Taksim in reality. But yet, I'm gonna ask the hard question, the questions you should ask as a buyer to any development you want to invest in, to get the real and the reality, the real value and the reality about this project. So let's ask the hard questions, let's start. Welcome Hadi, how are you? I'm great, how are you? I'm fine too, thanks. Thank you. Welcome, Eddie. Nice having you in our office. Thank you very much, Omnia. I know you since, I don't know, five, six years now? Yes, I it's guess so. We are so old friends. <laughs> perfect. perfect. I, I appreciate your time and having me here. So, Omnia, what we're going to do is I will be asking you some questions to understand the value of your project. So, actually, I can present it to my viewers to enable them to decide whether to invest in your project or not. So I usually start with the open question, which is why I should invest in your project. Uh, Taksim 360 project has two main points. One of them is the location. You know, location is very important in Istanbul. Sure. And Taksim is one of the first references for our project, for mm -hmm. the other project actually as a location. Second is the history parts here. Mm -hmm. We have here uh, history parts for, you know, many years and we are mixing this up with the modern life. That's I why see. it's a very important and valuable project. Actually, Taksim concept is a huge for me. I mean, we are literally in Taksim. We are not speaking next to Taksim. We are in Taksim, in Taksim itself. Exactly, yes. And I learned that this historical, as you just mentioned, are very old. Uh, I yes. mean, 100, 200 years old, right? Yes, some parts for, for more than 120 years and some parts for more than 200 years. All right, fair enough. That being said, my question now is, what's your prices? Actually, the prices here are not so expensive and are not so cheap. Okay. But I can guarantee that your investors or viewers will get the real value of the payment they're going to pay. I learned that this is an under construction project. I mean, there is part delivered but the majority of the project is under construction and at the same time, it's multi-usage project. Can you explain more what's the concepts you have in here? Actually, this project is a mixed project. We have here offices, um, we have here apartments, we have um, residential parts, we have another hotel and right. stores around the project. What's my risk? I mean, it's under yeah, construction. The project. <laughs> there should be a risk, so what, what's my risk in here? Actually, it's a good question, but there's no risk here because, first of all, we are signing here a notary contract. Which most, I mean, the majority of the Registered. projects do that, actually. Right, you are so right, but it's preserving your rights. Uh, legally. Right, legally. Exactly. Second, uh, our construction company is Chaluk Holding. We are talking uh, about yeah. one of the biggest holdings all over the world, not yes. just in Turkey. Yes, yes. Third, we have here already delivered some phases. So okay. these phases already have, uh, we can show the quality, we can show the title deeds of it. I see. Everything's so clear. Okay, but very quick question. Why the name Taksim 360? Uh, because of it's in the middle and it's in the only reference of I Istanbul. Which is Taksim and it's surrounded by everything. That's why I it's see. 360. All right. What about the investment aspects? I mean, what do you promise to your clients as a capital appreciation and rental income? In this location, in this project, the first two main points are capital appreciation and capital preservation. All right. So here the capital appreciation at least will be between 25% to 35% okay. every year, depends on the year. And the rental income will not be less than 8 to 10%. All right. But do you think 8 to 10% is achievable here? I mean, for example, it's a high number as a rental income. Yes, you so are right. So how can you justify? How can you relate on that? You know, Taksim is a touristic and business place, so we're going to here handle Airbnb system. That's why we will get rental, that high rental sense. income. That makes sense. All right. Maybe my last question for you is, Please. are the title deeds ready? I mean, for investors who's looking for getting the Turkish citizenship through 
$250,000 investment. Is it eligible? Is it pretty? Yes, 100% suitable for citizenship. All right. I appreciate your time, Omnia. Thank you very Thank much. You I believe I got all my answers to build my conclusion, to advise my viewers to consider this project or not. Thank right. you, Heidi, for this interview. And nice having you again in our office. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Hi again. So answering the question, should I buy in this project or not? As a fact, the projects in city center are two types. The first type is the urban renovation. I mean, they demolish a full neighborhood and they build a new compound. This is number one. Number two is the renovation projects where they take historical places, renovate them and make them a modern life living areas, which is exactly what is happening in this project that means this project is unique it is in taksim and it's one of a kind you cannot find such a concept in all istanbul actually especially in city center area so if you are looking for a unique investment with a very good window for exit for unique pro projects or properties this is the right answers for you so consider that make up your mind and if you have any question, give me a comment down there. I will get back to you. Thank you very much.